information. Police also searching for a suspect who carjacked and robbed a woman in Lawrence. CBS 4's Jesse Wells talked to that victim. She describes what she calls a terrifying ordeal. The victim told me she was not only robbed, but also kidnapped and forced to sit in the passenger seat of her own car while she was driven around by a complete stranger. Eventually, she was set free here at the transit center in downtown. Fortunately, she was not hurt in any way and lived to tell the tale. Walking out of this Dollar Tree on Pendleton Pike, a woman claimed she was ambushed by an armed carjacker while getting into her SUV on Monday. Before I could close the door, he kind of stepped in and showed me his pistol and was like, scoot over. That victim asked not to be identified, but says the suspect first drove her to this Huntington Bank location where the ATM is closed due to construction. We couldn't get money the first few times. He was like, oh, this is not good. This is not good. You better figure out how to get me some money. Like his goal was to get money. The armed thief then drove the woman to a second Huntington Bank here on East Washington, where he forced her to withdraw cash from her account. I kept crying and he was like, just, I'm not going to hurt you. Just shut up. Finally, after driving the woman to this bus station, the suspect stole her wedding ring and sped away in her silver Honda Pilot. I tried to give him my purse. I tried to give him my car. Like, just let me out. I just need to get out, get away. Like, you can have it all. I don't care about nothing, nothing but my life. The victim did well. Very frightening, of course. The Lawrence police chief praised the victim for complying with the suspect's demands, which is often the best way to stay safe. And yes, yeah, not worth uh, you know getting injured over getting physically injured as emotionally frightening as, as as traumatic as this incident is. Fortunately, she was physically uninjured. In the end, the woman told me the thief admitted he picked her at random. But I asked him like, why did you choose me? You know, and he just said, well, it just wasn't your lucky day. Again, because no arrests have been made in the case, anyone with information can still contact either the Lawrence Police Department or Crime Stoppers. Jesse Wells, CBS 4 News. Jesse, thank you.